Hey guys, welcome to Fun Fact Friday. So first fun fact, when you sound like this, you uh, can't actually do your audiobook narration because nobody wants to listen to this. So if you guys could be praying that my voice comes back soon because I have plenty of audiobooks to record and I don't want to sound like this when I do it. Um, so yeah, fun fact, you're losing your voice when you're a narrator, not a fun thing. I mean, it's never fun, but definitely not when you do that. But that's not my real fun fact. So my real fun fact is this. When you have written 47, 48 books, um, you, even if you have like a really good page of series characters, which I thought I did, uh, sometimes you can still make mistakes. So when I was writing Safe in My Arms, which is the one that just released, um, I could not remember whether the doctor's name was Brady or Brody. So I went into my character sheet. My character sheet said Brody, but for some reason I thought it was wrong <laughs> and it was Brady. So I changed it to Brady on my character sheet and then I wrote Brady in every single time it was used in this book. And then on Tuesday, well, which is actually Wednesday because I was late, but on Tuesday when I was reading the tidbit for you guys from Lost Memories and New Beginnings, I realized that his name originally was Brody. So I had to go back and change it. So nice thing about being an indie author is I was able to go in quickly and change it. But there are about uh, 400 of you who got basically a collector's item um, ebook and or paperback. There's only about six of these paperbacks in existence um, with the wrong name in them. So maybe there'll be collector's items one of these days. Um, so when you're, when you're writing as much as I am, and sometimes these series will sit for nine months before I can get around to finishing the next book, um, it's really easy to forget things. So I always try to be super organized so I can remember them, but it doesn't always work. So evidently Brady slash Brody Kavanaugh has a little bit of a personality crisis, kind of like me. Um, when I was growing up, my last name before I got married was Hannah. And so people tried to rhyme it, Lorana Hannah. And I was like, oh no, 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 it's pronounced Lorena, but nobody could get it. So I just went by Lori. So half of the people who knew me from when I was younger know me as Lori. And the other half of the people who knew me when I started teaching and they wouldn't let me go by Lori, but I had to go by Lorena, know me as Lorena. So I kind of feel like Brady slash Brody with my split personalities. I have two names that I answer to. Okay, that's it. I got to save my voice for the rest of today. Hopefully it gets better. That's my fun fact Friday and I'll see you guys later. Bye.